In the last video, we created an instant clone desktop pool from a golden image. But what do you do when you need to update the golden image? Horizon's push image operation makes it really easy to manage OS patches and updates. No downtime or maintenance windows required. Before you try this out, you need to have an existing instant clone desktop pool, and then you need to make changes to the golden image. You can either make changes to the VM you used the first time, or you can use a different VM entirely. And finally, you'll need to power off that change VM and take a VM snapshot. I'll just go through the snapshot part. I'm in the vCenter inventory here. I've got my powered off golden image VM. On the snapshots tab, you can see I already have the original snapshot called win10 pool snapshot. I'll take a new snapshot and name it OS update snapshot. Click create and here it is. Okay. Now we'll switch over to the Horizon console. Go to Inventory, Desktops, and click the name of the desktop pool. Click Maintain and select Schedule. I'm using the same VM in vCenter, so I don't need to change that. Now at first, I thought that the same VM meant the same golden image, so I selected this checkbox. But then I discovered that I couldn't select my new snapshot. So in this case, don't select the Use Current Golden Image checkbox. Now I can scroll down and select the new snapshot. Click Next. Scroll down the schedule page to see what all the options are. I think I'll select this one to force users to log off. Then I can also give them a warning message and decide how many minutes of warning to give. Click Next and then review the settings and click Finish. Now back on the Summary tab for the desktop pool, scroll down to the vCenter server section and the secondary image. Scroll back up and refresh the page. Remember, publishing an image can take several minutes. Notice over here in the second column, it lists the old snapshot as a snapshot while the new image is being published. The name of the new snapshot is down here in the secondary image area and under it, the operation is push image. Okay, when it gets all the way published under secondary image, it now says none and the golden image snapshot changes to the new snapshot name, OS updates snapshot and the state changes to published. You can scroll up and go to the machines tab. In the table, scroll to the right to see that the new snapshot was used for the VM. You can also click the machine name to go to the details page for it. The next time a user logs in, they will get the update. If I didn't use the option to force users to log off, then they would go on using the old image until they chose to log out of the machine. Then the next time they logged in, they would get the new image. This staggered approach to updates reduces boot storms and eliminates the need for maintenance windows. For more Horizon technical resources, be sure to visit techzone.vmware.com.